God the sustainer is the conception of God who sustains and upholds everything in existence. Al Qayyum, sometimes rendered the sustainer, is one of the 99 names of God in Islam. Creator, sustainer, redeemer is reportedly a common phrase in Protestantism in the United States, specifically in Baptist liturgy. Topic: Christian theology. In the Christian theology, the described doctrine is supported by the following biblical and deuterocanonical references. Wisdom 11:21-26: For you love all things that exist and detest none of the things that you have made, for you would not have made anything if you had hated it. How would anything have endured if you had not willed it? Or how would anything not called forth by you have been preserved? You spare all things, for they are yours, O Lord, you who love the living. John 5 verse 17, My Father is always at his work, even to this very day, and I am also working. Hebrews 1 verse 3, He upholds all things by the word of his power. Moreover, there are other relevant places in the doctrinal Christian literature, for example, Saint Augustine comments on John chapter 5 verse 17, Let us therefore believe that God works constantly, so that all created things would perish, if his working were withdrawn. The Catechism of the Catholic Church says in 301, with creation, God does not abandon his creatures to themselves. He not only gives them being and existence, but also, and at every moment, upholds and sustains them in being, enables them to act and brings them to their final end. Recognizing this utter dependence with respect to the Creator is a source of wisdom and freedom, of joy and confidence. In Islam God is known as the Sustainer Arabic, -razak within his 99 names. Sustenance is everything that can be benefited from. Sustenance can be divided into two parts, physical sustenance like food and spiritual sustenance with science and knowledge. Names of people with the name Abdul Razak also exist. The mentioned references in the Quran are Wayarzuku min haithu la yadasibu Wa meni yatakul la aha yajal lahu makraja Wa yarzakuhu min haithu la yadasib At Talak, 2-3 and whoever fears Allah, he will make for him a way out. And will provide sustain for him from where he does not expect. Wamakalakta aljina walinsa ila liabuduni ma ordu minham min rizki wama ordu an utamuni aina alaha wa alrazachu du alquati almatinu. Wa ma kalaktal jina wal insa ila liabudun. Ma yuridu minham mir rizkan wa ma yuridu eniutamun. Inal laaha hu were razachu zul kuwadal matin. Adh Dariat 56 to 58. And I did not create the jinn and mankind except to worship me. I do not want from them any provision, nor do I want them to feed me. Indeed, it is Allah who is the continual provider, the firm possessor of strength. Topic: <laughs> Hinduism. The conception of deity in a sustaining, conserving, preserving mode is also used in Hindu theology where the Godhead, or Trimurti in Sanskrit, consists of Brahma the creator, Vishnu the preserver, sustainer, and Shiva the destroyer. <laughs> Pantheism and pandeism In pantheism and pandeism pantheistic deism generally, God or some similar formulation is characterized as only needing to exist as a sustaining force, with no other aspect. 